you have to look at your business, there are two kinds of businesses. One which you can build without funding and one uh, where you necessarily need funding. Uh, so if you're talking about the latter here, let's say today if you want to go heads on against Flipkart, uh, you might not be able to bootstrap it because there's a huge operational cost, logistics, warehouse, people, so on and so forth. And at that point in time, you realize that bootstrapping is not a ideal or optimal choice. This is if you're building a technology business where, hey, you know what, a bunch of guys, co-founders or early employees can come sit in a room build some technology, spend about a year or two, find customers for that, and your defensibility is in the technology, uh, that's a great choice to bootstrap. Uh, a better sort of uh, validation is if your competitor raises more money than you or raises any amount of money, will they be able to beat your technology or distribution skills overnight? If not, bootstrap it. If yes, uh, probably you might need funding. If you're a first-time entrepreneur, I would highly recommend bootstrapping in the initial stages. So what happens is typically what I've seen in India, uh, a lot of the entrepreneurs in the tech domain are tech guys. Uh, they're always in that build mode. And when you're in the build mode, you have not learned how to sell. What bootstrapping enables you to do is focus on a balance of building and selling. Because if you don't have money from customers, you don't know how you're gonna pay your next month's salaries. So it forces you to do things outside your comfort zone. Vis a vis, if you raise money from VC, you can be in a perpetual build mode and at a later point realize that, hey, nobody's willing to buy. So at that point, you have to turn a larger ship around, which is much more difficult than turning a much smaller ship around. So first-time entrepreneurs bootstrap till a point. Then if you feel the need to raise money uh, so that you can probably invest more in sales, marketing, possibly even engineering, by all means and go. So the bootstrapping versus funding is not uh, not a question which is like uh, you can answer with a single variable in the equation. It depends on the timing. When should you raise money? It depends on whether if you raise money, will that give you a competitive advantage? C, has somebody else raised money? D, are you talking about perseverance over pace? Will pace actually help you grow much faster, be the single stop solution or the product for that market? But if it's about perseverance, I think bootstrapping is better.